Hello everyone. Oh, I look skinny. Good morning. God, why do I look oily? I'm supposed to be looking cute. <clears throat> it is <clears throat> like 7.30. My flight, shut up dad. My flight's at 11. Um, I have pillow pet and uh, not infinity, you know, donut. I have the bitches. They're saying deuces to me. El Padre. We are going to the elevator right now. I'll report back later. All right. So Byron wanted me to record. What well, happens? So get up there. We'll leave your shoes off, except for you. You <laughs> got your hand. Uh, we'll leave jackets I, off. They're heavier. I ones. won the raffle. Uh, no, I'm joking. Uh, basically, I don't have to take off my shoes. And left off the computer. I'm checking. Have one. Pick it up. Put it in the bin. So basically what you do is you take out all your shit and then like your carry-on stuff and that's about it. So yes. Okay, um I recorded some of the going through terminal, but not that much. Um I am currently, you know, walking through the hallway trying to find my terminal. I have the worst heartburn right now. It hurts like a bitch, so I went to Hudson News. I got some spray. There were some really nice Indian and Muslim ladies. So that's really nice. I also got some Oriental Mix, because that's the best. Damn, this thing is deep. <sighs> My next play is Dallas, though. And Dallas has, like, one of the biggest fucking airports in America. Or is the biggest. Look at this nice-ass restaurant. Delta High My Club, though. Um, but, yeah. It's kind of relaxed. There's not, like, faggoty-ass tourists everywhere. So, yeah. Okay. Um, I recorded some of the going through terminal but not that much um i am currently you know walking through the hallway trying to find my terminal <sighs> i have the worst heartburn right now it hurts like a bitch so i went to hudson news i got some spray there were some really nice indian and muslim ladies so that's really nice i also got some oriental mix because that's the best damn this thing is deep <sighs> my next play is dallas though and dallas has like one of the biggest fucking airports in america or is the biggest look at this nice ass restaurant Delta High My Club, though. Um, but yeah, it's kind of relaxed. There's not like faggoty ass tourists everywhere. So yeah. Um, your bitch is fucking tired. And I still have heartburn, so. So I am um, taking a shit with my um, tummies. These things really good. Really nice. Okay, I know it looked like shit. Um, basically, I sat in the bathroom for like half an hour taking anti-acid chewable tablets and drinking Sprite and sitting on the floor without a shirt on because I felt very nervous and overwhelmed because I hate pain. <sighs> and I took off my makeup because I feel like I look like the clown and the anti- or not- <laughs> That heartburn really made me feel what's up. And I look like a little faggot, like those airport faggots that, you know, wear this thing. God damn it, my blanket is on my calves right now. Like, literally on my calves. Okay. Anyway. Oh, God, there's actually people here. I was going to Dallas. <laughs> oh, whoops, but I'm in the correct flight. And I don't know if you can hear me. Now I'm heading to Munich and I have to book on over because my boarding time just started. So, you know. Okay, currently, oh God, my voice is currently in Munich trying to find my terminal. Where am I? Where am I? I think I'm age 19. I'm trying to book my ass over there. Alright, so I found, trying to find food, um, I found my flight, I didn't have to go through passport control, which is weird because I thought I would, look, there's a smoking lounge behind me, fun fact, Europe loves to smoke, oh, these are hecka cute, look at this, you see that, that's cute, anyway, the reason, what the hell is this, god, never mind, European the reason why I was angry on the last flight, the reason why I put that video, 
It's because of my fight, flight to the, where was I going to? Oh my God, <sighs> love you. Because on my way, sorry, I'm like a hoarder right now looking at everything. <laughs> oh God. There's so much fun stuff here. <clears throat> on my way to, uh, to whatever my second flight was, I don't know. The guy right next to me was like probably getting hecka annoyed by me. And then I had this like weird pilot guy right next to me. I don't know, it was like really, he was just giving me a lot of anxiety. And then I was freaking out because my flight was right after each other. So I was like, what the fuck? But I'm solid. I'm here now, I have like 10 minutes before. I don't think I have time to buy anything. Oh my God, look at these. I wanna buy these for my keys, can I? Look at these, look. I don't want to buy one. How much are they? I'm like on six ninety, and that's in euros. And I don't know what the transfer is. So I'm not gonna buy anything from here. That shit is hell expensive. The fuck? You got me messed up. Some of that's for a little bell. It is cute though. Oh my god, they have ice cream. Oh, they have cookie dough ice cream. Do I want cookie dough ice cream? But Europe food is so expensive. Or like uh, at least airport food is. Should I get ice cream? I don't know. I really want ice cream. Oh my god, there's Kinder. Okay. All right, I'm gonna go now because I'm just bad. Okay, quick little thing. Do you see how tall these are? What about the King County Library? They were like this. You could see it for Spain. In Europe, we don't play with privacy. Oh my god, look at that. They know that all oh, these people are coming from America to travel, so they're like, we need to accommodate for that shit, you know? All right, so I am here now in Sarajevo. I just wanted to show you the baggage claim. It's just a one baggage claim, pretty simple. Um, I'm really hoping my stuff didn't get lost. Because <laughs> one of my planes, I had to run to the other. But then again, they delayed us an hour because of the baggage, so you know. I mean, my, I am priority, obviously. But no, that's not mine. Okay, I'll get back to you guys later when I'm in the taxi cab with my uncle. <laughs> This is a little tea shop. Very cute. I'm taking the bus to my aunt who is popping. So, and, but I will admit we are in a cute little hipster tea shop which I didn't even know they had in Sarajevo. So, when I'm with my big ass suitcase, people are staring at me on the road. Like, who the fuck is this? Like, like first they're like, they're like, hold on, this eyeliner, like that's not Bosnian. She looks Serbian, I mean, look at her eyebrows. Okay, she's fat, so she's maybe not pure Serbian, but then look at her clothes. They think I'm a poor person, or what we call Tsikanka. And it's like really uncomfortable and awkward because like I can be cool and weird in America, but like in Bosnia, I can't, so. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> and I'm gonna take a three hour bus. <sighs> I just can't wait to sleep. I did not sleep at all on the airplane. The airplane was rough as fuck. Okay, I'm gonna go now, bye. <laughs> just wanted to show you guys a quick little thing. I'm waiting for the tram. We have a tram. This is what the streets look like. There are things like that. That's a church. But I wanted to show you specifically this building. You can see it's pretty torn up. And I just asked my uncle how long it's been like that. And it's been like that since the war. And that was 20 years ago. Look at this fucking driver guy. He's being hella funny. Anyway, so I just wanted to tell you uh, that's what Europe is, or at least Bosnia. They're not like America where you can just fix up something that's been on fire. Um, oh my god, this Bosnian guy was watching it. That's really uncomfortable. <clears throat> Hello, y'all. I don't know how crazy you look right now. Um, long story short, like eight hours later, I am in I am in Kupras now, which is like a town three, four hours away from the capital, sorry, where the, the airport is. So it's like driving from Normandy Park to like... 
Canada, maybe. I don't know. <sighs> anyway, I'm here. This is the, the room I'm going to stay. I'm going to do a room, um, like a house tour tomorrow because I think that'd be kind of fun. Um, but anyway, I mean, I'm going to do like a whole summary thing tomorrow because I'm like really pooped and I, I think this video is already going to be super long. So I'm going to like try and edit it. <laughs> I'm a YouTuber. Am I right? Not really. But I did want to show you a quick little thing. So this is what I like to call a travel adapter. And when you look, can you see that? See how there's only two holes? Well, <laughs> uh, uh, no. So what this does, how do I actually do this? So you put, theoretically, you should be able to put that in. Oh, fuck. Is it not working? What the hell? Okay. This is supposed to work, so beer. Okay, I got it to work. You just have to push really fucking hard, but see, it adapts. So now my laptop and thing. Sad thing is I only have one of those, so it's either my phone or the laptop. But the nice thing is though about laptops is they have the little, you know, what's that flash drive thing? USB port it has a USB port, so I can technically charge this or that. So anyway, yeah. All right, I'm gonna go to bed now. So good night.